Hi, I'm Kathy, and I'm one of the hygienists here at Greeley Dental Care. If your hygienist has recommended that you have scaling and root planing, what that means is that there are bacteria and toxins below the gum line that are creating disease and inflammation. So what we need to do is uh, numb up those gums so we can go underneath the gum line and clean all that out so we can restore your mouth to health. I typically say it's a non-surgical approach. We don't want you to go down to the other end of the office where you're seeing the doctors to have to have some teeth removed because there's so much bone loss. We want to get to um, that therapy before that happens. During that scaling and root planing appointment, we use um, different ways to make the gums and the teeth numb. We use special instruments that go underneath the gum line very precisely to remove all that hard tartar, that plaque, that bacteria that's causing the disease so that um, we effectively can help um, your mouth get back to that state of health. The other things that we do during uh, that specialized cleaning the non-surgical periodontal therapy that we call it, deep scaling, scaling and root planing, it's known by a lot of different terms, is that we have the capacity to use a laser. And a laser is a concentrated light, as you know, that we take underneath the gum line to decontaminate that pocket area to sterilize it to give those gums the best um, response and healing as we can. We also have the capacity to use some, a low-grade antibiotic called a Restin that we can put down into those areas that don't want to heal so that they have a chance to heal as well. What you can typically expect after that deep cleaning, the scaling or root planing, or what I like to say, the non-surgical approach to gum therapy is that you will be numb for a little while after the appointment. So we wanna make sure that you are very careful with what you eat and you drink until that numbness goes away. After that, during that first day, we'll ask you just to limit the um, foods that are spicy, uh, probably crunchy, hard. We don't want you to have to go down and underneath the gum line to clean anything out since we've just done that therapy on you. But usually after that first 24 hour period, things are back to normal and your mouth is healthy and we just give you all the to tools that you need um, to re restore your mouth to the health that it deserves.